My goal is to educate and empower you with skincare knowledge to achieve and maintain a flawless complexion. Now, given the importance of maintaining your skin barrier, what can you do to keep it healthy and functional? Well, let's look at five strategies to help you with that. Listen, boo, I got you, okay? Now, strategy number one, I want you to simplify your skincare routine. So if you're performing all kind of complicated steps and it involves a bunch of products, this may be inadvertently weakening your skin barrier. And this is what we call sensitized skin. Um, consider talking to a dermatologist or a skincare expert about the essential and most effective products to use. And if you're exfoliating, I want you to notice how your skin reacts when you're using this method. Because according to the Academy of Dermatology, those with sensitive skin and darker skin tones may want to use a soft cloth and a mild chemical exfoliant. Some types of scrubs and brushes may temporarily damage your skin barrier, and we don't want that. Okay? Strategy number two, pay attention to your skin's pH. Now your skin's natural pH is about a 5.7, but some skincare products range from 3.7 all the way to 8.2. And researchers recommend cleansing products that are closer to your skin's natural pH, which is 5.7. So keeping it in this range will help protect you from skin conditions such as dermatitis, dry skin, and preventing your acne from flaring. And I know not all products actually list their, um, their pH, but you know, do the best that you can and use more uh, liquid-based cleansers.